Welcome back to the channel guys. We got the boat back. We got a fresh new lower unit on there and we went fishing today. Um, so it was a tough day out there. Some strange things happened so you'll get to see throughout the video. I'm filming the intro after the day of fishing uh, because I was out on the water before the sun even came up to try and get a shad spawn bite and try and figure these fish out because I haven't fished in Pennsylvania for two months. So we were trying to figure something out today and it was a grind. We didn't really figure anything out, but we did have some fun, catch some fish. Um, I didn't focus too much on the B-roll in today's video and like really producing it as well as some of my later, my latest ones uh, because I was fishing with a longtime friend I haven't seen in a while. So we mostly focused on fishing and hanging out and I just filmed a video along the way. But some strange things happened, so stay tuned for that. See some weird fish catches and some funny uh, things that happened throughout the day. So before we get into today's video, catching some fish with the boat again, um, she's not going to be back for long. We have some exciting news coming for the channel. I don't want to announce it yet, but you can probably get an idea of what it's going to be. Um, so we're going to talk about that in some future videos. but. She's going to be on her way here shortly, um, but we will be fishing out of her for the next couple weeks, and we're even going to fish with my dad coming up. Um, we'll talk more about the, the Leave It on the Scale series where that lays with the lower unit on what tournaments we missed there and stuff, uh, but we're going to add an episode to that series with my dad. We're going to fish the Bass Pro US Open on the Potomac River. We're going to try and qualify for the championship to fish for a million dollars, two trucks, and two boats. So that's a very exciting episode coming up as well, so make sure you stay tuned for that. Hit that subscribe button down below if you don't want to miss that. We're going to be grinding out on the Potomac to try and get our chance to fish for a million dollars. All right, so we're starting right next to the ramp here today. There's some bushes in the water right here. They just had a tournament yesterday, so I'm assuming there's probably some fish in there. We're going to start with a flipping bait and see what happens. And both, do you have fish? Yep. Nice. That was easy. Sanko in. He was in the middle of nowhere. There was nothing there. That's funny. He was. In... Yep. Nice. Flipping. First one of the year. <laughs> it only took till July. <laughs> We're on them. Today's going to be fun. So Garrett just caught one on a Senko. And the next tree down, I just caught that guy. Not a big one, but we're going to go ahead and let her go and try and find some bigger ones. She was not happy I caught her. Got him. Wow, he is small. Oh, <laughs> uh, hey, hey. He's literally the size of this beaver. Look at this. How did he think he was going to eat that? Well, I'm going to throw him back. Yeah, he did. Fish? Yep. Net? Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, he ate it like as I was bringing it in. I'll just grab him. The net's okay. in the box. Yeah, that's fine. Damn. That was. That's a good one. Yeah. That's a good one. Yeah. Garrett's got the first big one of the day here. Almost a three pounder. We're gonna go ahead and throw him back and try and get some bigger ones. He did catch that on a Senko, so maybe we'll have to switch it up. There she goes. There we go. Chatterbait fish. Chatterbait fish. He's hooked on the outside of the mouth. Oh no, he's hooked on the inside. We're gonna throw him back. Try and get a bigger one. He made the biggest splash that could have ever happened when I just threw him back right there. 20 pounds every time. Got that one. Little flipping guy. Yeah. They're all small though. He ate it while I was reeling it in. Yeah, it's weird. I feel like everyone. But they won't eat like a chatterbait. Oh, like I I fished that bush up there on the bank, 
got done fishing that bush, I went to just reel it in. I hopped it up off the bottom and crushed it. Sorry, bud. We're gonna let him go real fast. He's bleeding, so we're gonna throw him back. Can you hand me that other peanut butter and jelly out of there, please? I don't remember. Either way. I mean, yeah, you can make generic with just this for it even, but... Oh, what the... No way that just happened. <laughs> Dude! <laughs> what? She got my... <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh, he's blind in one eye and has a call tag through his mouth. That's why he ate it. There's a call tag. Oh my god. His jaw's broken in half. I've never this seen fish that. is beat. Wow. Sandwich is good though. <laughs> that might have been the funniest thing I've ever seen. We're gonna go ahead and throw him back. Oh my god. That's why you never put the, the rod too. down. Was... You should be chucking your Senko Jeffries again. No way. <laughs> oh no! First cast. <laughs> I'm getting one out. We're gonna get the line up. We're getting the line up. I get him? I don't know. Yep, I got him. Oh, it's a giant too. A that was the most awkward hook set ever. Yeah. What do I have? What the fuck is that? Dude, I don't know what I have. This is giant. Go ahead, the net's under there. Yeah. It's gotta be a catfish. That was the most awkward hook set I have ever done. This has to be a catfish. Is it just, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is it? It's a catfish. I didn't see it. <laughs> catfish, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like you said. <laughs> that was the most awkward hook set I have ever done. Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> it was like, <laughs> <laughs> like and then it took rods, off under there. Like under your rods, yeah. Oh, today has been, today has been weird. <laughs> you want him to eat? Um, <laughs> nah, I don't feel like it. <laughs> <laughs> Just break all my rods, go ahead. Why don't you? All right, we're going to throw him back. That's about a summary of the day. Catfish and weird biting catfish bass. <laughs> You want to see a big catfish, which is uh, just a, a Texas rigged creature bait. He was an accidental. Yeah, not even. yeah he broke my rod. Oh, he did. <laughs> yeah, he broke this one. Is that the one the catfish Yeah. I broke three rods this year so far. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, catching some fish out there. Uh, it was a very tough day. The fish weren't where I thought they would be, and then they also weren't in the other place I thought they would be, so they were kind of scattered out a little bit of everywhere. Never really got on some type of pattern, uh, but we did have a couple of those crazy little fish catches there um, that I've never seen before and that were a little bit awkward. So hope you enjoyed today's video. There's better content coming now that we got the boat back. Uh, today was just a trial run to make sure everything worked, make sure we're all good to go, and now we're going to hit it hard and start producing some really good YouTube content for you guys. So if you enjoyed today's video, leave a like down below. Make sure you hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any more of my videos coming up.